Who the hell made this thing? Well, that was a real dangerous fight. Last play two seconds. That didn't happen. Where am I? Oh. Aroga. Wow. Thanks, game. <laughs> Making it easier for us. Oh god. Yeah, these things are shorter than I remember. I don't remember ever whiffing hits just because of how short. There, yeah, finally. I forgot how to do that trick. Used to be actually pretty good at doing that. Then again, I haven't played this game in all couple of years. I'm assuming they're on the roof. I don't know where else they could be. I guess they could be underneath the tree house. Oh, there's one. What the hell is one doing? Oh, it must have fell through the floor. Alright, okay. By the way, I knew this that, that could happen. The leopard, tiger, whatever the hell animal it is, cheetah, Chester the cheetah. Uh, I knew it could do that occasionally. Or it, it could just bust through the ground. I think it, because it can come through multiple. It could just be sitting here, like jump up from up here, and even probably jump out of the window. And occasionally, if you, occasionally it will jump to the floor, break the floor. Uh,. But that is actually the first time in a playthrough that has happened. I've never actually had this happen uh, before in any other playthrough. It's the first time. So that's actually kind of crazy that it's also the time my guy recorded it happening. So. Neat. Oh, great. Damn it. I didn't have time to move. Cheap shot. Alright then. Damn it, it happened again. Get him. Get him, guys. Damn it. Stunned impact was too slow. No finisher. This is why the Lion King's better. Yeah, parry him. Good job, Goofy. Parried him. My fang, he just carved off his fang.
cut it out. Whereas, whereas a necklace. Look at that texture faced. Game running at 120 frames. See if I can still play as smoothly. Okay, I wasn't ready. If I remember correctly, you don't want to actually land like finishers on him. It's just better. Damn, he just threw a potion. Is that the only boss in the game, if I remember correctly, that does that, that heals him? Oh, great. Yeah. It was a lot easier. Now, time to prepare for me to die like 20 times to this boss. That rock is just floating there. Oh wait, no, it's the chat, chat not the map. Now it's time for Clayton and his invisible chameleon. That dude just shot a child. Rest this man. Yeah, one shot. Yeah, okay, I'm sorry. What? What was that? Get yeah, one shot from the chameleon. Man, glass cannon sword sucks. Why did I choose their magic rod and gave up defense for this shit? Fuck. I tried. Hey, you know what? Having a little issue. I'm not sure. If I can't, I just go to the menu. Does anyone else hear that? That's not a normal sound effect. Where is that coming from? Where's that sound effect coming from? Gone now, I don't know where the hell that was. A oh, great you. I don't need you. At least not yet. Someday. <coughs> Damn. I, I'm, I'm sorry, what? My favorite part about this boss fight is that it starts with camera facing away from the boss fight so you have to reset the camera and spin of like a half a second which doesn't sound like a lot but you would think that the courtesy or the smart move in gaming is that when you're doing a boss fight you don't start the camera facing the opposite way of the boss 
Now I know this is a 2002 game. This game is 20 years, over 20 years old. Almost like, what, 22? Damn. That thing comes out of nowhere. You know, I like Kingdom Hearts 1. It's janky. I know it's janky. That's why I like it. I like it some of its jank. It's a little charming and unique. But not all of its jank is good. Yep, like that. That's also one. Easy. Not a problem at all. Definitely the easiest boss fight in the game. Easy boss fight in the game. Clayton with his invisible chameleon. I was gonna say that's not how he dies in the movie, but then again, there also was not an invisible chameleon in the movie. There it is, the Holy Grail, the game that makes this game playable. I'm just kidding. The game's playable without it. No, it's not. It really isn't. Cure was not in this game. This will not. It would be as fun of a video game. So it was like I said at the beginning. Deep jungle. Not that difficult of a world. Definitely not confusing, frustrating, and long and overbearing. And you know what? The weird thing about that is I'm not being sarcastic. Deep jungle is actually one of my more favorite ones. I like it still more... A kind of way that there's ways to really get around. Like the ability to like just skip the slider all together by quitting. Skip, uh, and then uh, sk uh, like quitting, like avoiding the rope jumps by starting the game and quitting. It's like a lot of its movement, or like a lot of the movement you kind of you can do to walk through the world is kind of fun. Uh, boss fight. Not my favorite. Clayton. Well, it is difficult. <laughs> this model. <laughs> Oogie Boogie. This model's not animated. Never noticed that. He still isn't. Ursula is in the background. But Oogie Boogie, <laughs> he's bit, Oogie Boogie almost looked like he's t posing. Spooky Boogie. I'm gonna be a little honest. 
I haven't actually seen these cutscenes in like years. I replay the Kingdom Hearts games like at least I replay one Kingdom Hearts game once a year. Like every year I will replay a Kingdom some Kingdom Hearts game. Whatever I would feel like replaying. But I always skip the cutscenes and never rewatch them. I watched the cutscenes once when I first played them. But every other time after that, I've never really rewatched the cutscenes. I maybe watch some of my favorite ones when I get to them. But I never rewatched all the cutscenes. So honestly, I forget most of them. Especially Kingdom Hearts 1. Uh, now I'm going back and actually watching them while playing them and not skipping them. Yeah, you definitely see this game's age a lot more. There's some things I didn't finish. Tunnel, is that where I want to go? Here, here. Before we end the episode. Let's do this mini game. Do the clicking through ones if I can remember. Failed already. Great. I can get the uh, cure art. Right, uh, yeah, cure arts. Did I get the um, other ones? Alright, so here is the thing the age old question of Kingdom Hearts where does cure go in your shortcuts? Now, Kingdom Hearts 2 is, might be slightly different, but Kingdom Hearts 1, where does Kingdom Hearts shortcut go? X, triangle, square, circle, Kingdom Hearts 2, you know, like 3. And... But here's my answer. My answer? It doesn't go on the shortcut list. You navigate through the, to cure through the command menu, like the real man, like the real man Sora is. Sora would have done. He doesn't shortcut his cure, he navigates through it. That's canon, by the way. The command menu is canon to story. I just made it up, but I made it canon now. Also, I have this. I guess I could have equipped this to increase my strength during the Clayton fight. Get rid of oh, yeah, if her. Just resist fire damage. Also, I have like, zero experience. That gives you like a strength buff, doesn't it? In Kingdom Hearts 1? Yeah, that, it does, doesn't it? I think it does. I could have done that. Probably made it a lot easier. Get that plus one strength from uh, the white thing I could have equipped. I also could have um, equipped zero experience. Now I don't know how much of a bonus it gives you. If it really would have meant, or if it like the difference is like, oh, you only I only need like one less combo to beat Clayton. That's but. Yeah, I guess something is uh, different. The strength boost is a strength boost. No. Fuck. Alright. 
Now time for the third one. Whoa. Oh, easy. It's probably the easiest one. Whoa, see that? Sora was gliding on nothing. Should I, should I do this or not? Damn it. No. Oh. Suck at these. I guess this every time. <laughs> no. I'm not lying when I say I'm going to guess that spot every time. When I don't know, I'm gonna probably guess that one. Yay, Thunderstone, right? Lightning Stone, I'm sorry. The Thunderstone is from Pokemon. This is not the final one. I just do remember the final one being in like a cave, like the second one. Can't see where they come from. Defense up. All right. Next one for sure should be the final one. Look, there's a chest up there I missed. Damn it, Mooney. Open that chest before more. Let's just make a potion, but try to get all the treasure I can. Okay. Middle. Left. Then this should be the final one. Yep, here we go. There we go. First try. Easy. Twenty five. Okay. Take me back to the tent with Miss Janie. You again. Do this and that's going to be the end of the episode don't think we need to stay any longer here all right that's everything here to do in deep jungle so next episode I'm sure we'll go to the next world so yeah, thanks for watching, goodbye.